three in the morning and she still sells bacon wrapped hot dogs. Something's going on there that put yellow tape up. Good morning, Los Angeles. This is the early morning edition GRV on the road. And I'm sitting right in front of 7-Eleven in my car and I'm drinking a piping hot caffeinated beverage on the go. Check this out. Lottery, $493 million and $330 million. Welcome to all the subscribers and the ones that did not subscribe yet. You might wanna subscribe after this video. I'm still going for the million. Anyway, the lighting is really good here because they got those really bright lights here at 7-Eleven. <clears throat> I went to the beach today on Saturday, but I didn't feel like working because I was editing all night till eight in the morning. So I got to the beach really late. And uh, after the beach, I went home. I slept for three hours and now I'm all energized. It's in the middle of the night. And I saw something on uh, TikTok that they sprayed another graffiti on that building. And that was so amazing, crazy, that I said, I got to go there today. Maybe it's going to happen again. Maybe I can see something else. So I'm actually on my way to downtown LA. I know you've seen the videos before, what the building looks like, and you're probably tired of looking at it. But you never know what's going to happen, you know, when you go downtown in the middle of the night. So I don't want to stay at home. I don't want to sleep. I just want to drive around and uh, we'll see what's going to happen. And I wish you a beautiful Sunday and enjoy this video. Currently, it's just drizzling outside and I'm heading to downtown Los Angeles at 3 a.m. All you guys were sleeping while I was doing this video. Jayla, what are you doing up at 3 a.m.? Wow, I didn't expect that many people driving on the freeway at that time. The squares around the window looks good. Three in the morning and she still sells bacon wrapped hot dogs. Something's going on there that put yellow tape up. It was probably a concert going on and now they're packing everything. A lot of people are afraid to come downtown in the middle of the night. Those guys make a living here. I bet you can get a good deal on some bacon wrapped hot dogs right now. Half price. Nothing going on here. He's entertaining the police. The last week I'm spending so much time here. I know all the officers already here. They say, hey, what's up, GIV? <laughs> he just asked him if they... <laughs> he wants to get a... Hey, you can only get a ride home in handcuffs, man. <laughs> they don't want to give me a ride home. I am like, what are you guys doing right here? Please give me a ride home. <laughs> I don't have an Uber. That's you not. A, that's definitely not an Uber. You don't want to sit in that Uber, man. I am. They don't <laughs> want to give me Uber. Like, that. what are you guys doing? They already got all this shit, right? That's right. Oh, it's a sprinkle. Well, right? there's there's really no Uber with lights on top. Okay, so. <laughs> I don't have money on my pocket. <laughs> He's funny. He asks every cop to drive him home. Uh, right now I'm chasing reality. Boom, but dude, I'm more stoked me. on the I'm German. Him, yeah. I'm more stoked on the German. All right, so we had some turf wars here. There was a street vendor selling their hot dogs and their beer. And then another street vendor came here and tried to intimidate them and told them, get out of here. You go sell your hot dogs somewhere else. I'm going to sell my hot dogs here. Okay. Those hot dog guys didn't like it and they got into a fight. And that's why there's hot dogs and beer everywhere. 
Let's go check it out, he man. Got, he, he got stabbed. What? He was, yeah, he was, the aggressor was stabbed, taken to the hospital, and then the guys who stabbed him took off that way. Over now, a hot dog. Over hot dogs. And now there's free beer. And uh, if you want, there's hot dogs as well. Wow. But the uh, LAPD said we are uh, we can have the beer if we want. But I will put them up here for somebody. Oh, they're cold too. They're cold. Free beer here. And a Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. They don't. Have, Coca -Cola. They don't have a diet. That's Coca -Cola. That's Coca -Cola. LAPD told me to come get it. Hey, you want free beer? Yeah, LAPD put over there. <laughs> uh, look at this. Beer. Go for it. Plenty of bacon wrapped hot dogs for free. Like, hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and grab a water too, it's healthy. <laughs> hey, and then there's some food. <laughs> Got the Gatorade. I'm good. We're just cleaning up. So they took the yellow tape away already. And he's actually a streamer. He's driving around all night over there and he goes to police calls and records it. That's what he does for a living. The guy over there with the with the shirt. Look at this, all the beer right there. Hey, what is your, how do they find you on the internet? What's that? How oh, can, um, uh, Chasing Reality OSTV. All yep, right. Or Chasing Reality Scott Lane. However, all right. uh, however you want. And some propane gas. Somebody was selling braiding a birthday too. Look, those are all full cans of Modelo beer. This is all their beer. Remember my last videos, I always see all those vendors and always wonder, isn't there like a little fight? Because there's so many next to each other and everybody's like going lower on the price. Some are $5, some sell them for 10, nine, eight. So that happened tonight and one person got stabbed, he said. Yeah. What a bummer. Yeah, this was, a, this was a turf war thing. I actually thought that was a police car because you got a light on the side. So you listen to the scanner and then you go to the locations. This is the ultimate media machine. And it's been raining, so I have my, uh, my, my, rain, my rain tower there. But go ahead and take a look. All uh, right, let me put my, I'm actually with my scooter here and today. And check out a show on Netflix. What? Look at it. Check out a show on Netflix called Shot in the Dark. Shot in the Dark on Netflix. Oh, we check I'm it Scott out. Lee. And look, there's ladies walking around by themselves in the middle of the night. Sure. Let me go from the other side to see the other side right here. So it looks like a police car here. It's a Dodge. Take a look. You got the police light on the side right here. Look at all the stuff. All the scanners he has right here. Wow. And he just goes along all night long. Yep, and it has some bells and whistles and stuff. Oh, it has some bells and whistles. Six rescue, six going up for a bank. Pretty cool. Nice. But yeah, uh, listen for the scanners. Can you actually get those scanners easily yeah, yeah, or what? On, on eBay, and then I... Uh, you know, I just don't do live. I'm a. Uh, uh, you know, wow. You sell it to the news. Onscene.tv. You know, when you're watching TV on, and you see the Onscene logo? Okay. Onscene TV. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Onscene TV. Nice. I mean, he got everything. That's it's like. for the news. It's not just, uh, not just the, uh, you know. Streaming service and things like that. Not just, uh, yeah, no ABC, CBS. Man, I really want to ride along one day with you, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, um, are you on Instagram? Yeah. Because I'll DM you on Instagram. Venice fifty one fifty. Venice fifty one fifty. Yeah.
See, you a follow, if I would have message and hello. See, if I would have stayed at home, I would have never met this guy. Who knows? Maybe one day I'm gonna ride along with him, and uh, that would be actually a cool video too. Yeah, yeah, dude. My my Oma would be stoked. To Dino, find out that Dino I Oma. Is she yeah, I have, German? I have an Oma. Okay. I have an Oma. I'm, I'm, I'm half German. All right. I have an Oma. Um, my Oma is up north right now. She's 93 degrees. 93 degrees. 93 years old. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I gotta go visit her. Uh, her birthday is in March, so I gotta go see her in March. Well, it's pretty cool to meet you. Let me follow you right back, and then you can text me on Instagram. Yep, I just uh, said hello to well, you. It's really right. nice meeting you. Take care, man. Thank you, I'll and... see you in the future, and I can't wait to give you a ride one day. Maybe on the weekends when it's busy, Absolutely. when something is going on. I actually thought that was an undercover police car. They're coming from everywhere now. But I want to show you something. My bike battery's dead, so I gotta use the scooter, but I'm filming right now. That's why I'm not riding it. Um, I saw something on TikTok again. They actually put some more graffiti up there, but this time, I don't know how they did it. I'm gonna show you, and you're like, what? Wow, a lot of activity going on here. Downtown Los Angeles. Almost four o'clock in the morning. I could still take pictures with Kobe. The reason why I came here is this. Yesterday I was here at the art show. I spent six hours here and I didn't want to stay all night. Should have, could have. That would have been a good video. I zoom in. This is unbelievable. So you see the MTA. All the stuff here is new too. But look at the one in the middle. How in the world did they put that one up in the middle? S-A-U-T. Wow. I just wanted to know how they put it up there. Can they walk up there or did they let themselves down on like a long rope? I've seen that before. Wow, I was hoping there was some action going on because I saw that they yesterday already started putting new fencing around it. So Ocean White Plaza has till tonight to respond and clean up the mess, but it looks like they're not gonna do anything. So starting the 18, the city is gonna take over. And I was here yesterday earlier and I saw they're already putting up barricades. They're gonna build like a big secure fence so nobody can climb over it anymore you've seen in my videos that they can slide through the fence really quick they all have holes in it it looks like they're building something permanently so people can go into those buildings i mean like a fence but made out of wood so you can't cut holes in it Yesterday and today there was a rodeo going on at the crypto arena. Four o'clock in the morning. Yes, he goes home. Now the GIV is here by himself. The city council just okay 3.8 million dollars to clean up the graffiti and secure the premise all the way around the three buildings. 3.8 million. Not only tagging is going on, they also put stickers everywhere here. There's some actually I recognize. Well, that is another one for the record. In a city where millions of people are around, I'm the only one here at the crypto arena I mean, it was said now it's Sunday morning, almost four o'clock. Won't forget that. All the lights are off. Everybody's sleeping at the Ritz Carlton. That makes a good photo. Now I blame myself that I didn't come here yesterday because I was editing the video for the art show till eight in the morning. 
we're standing on the ledge to put that one on. No stopping any time. They covered up that hole. Going up all the way to the 50th floor, you're gonna be exhausted when you get there. Do not board this one. Look at all the stickers. more drama I actually thought about it before to get a police scanner and then on the Saturday or Sunday when I'm not busy filming I'm just gonna drive around and I go to all those locations where something is happening there's a lot of people doing that I never done it it's not that easy we gotta you gotta know the area pretty well but I like stuff like this he has that light shining up there to see there's any people there it's really hard to see if you don't have a flashlight like they have but he's been shining up there in that corner space So I'm just talking to a police officer here and he told me they arrested the guy. This is actually not his name. He had to come down before they finish it, I guess. Yeah. And he was repelling. He was repelling from a rope, huh? Yeah. Now we know how he did it. Wow. Yeah. That's even more dangerous. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Crazy, huh? Well, thank you for your info. Yeah, absolutely. So he's still shining up there. There might be something going on over there. Can you believe it? Repelling down from a rope and then somebody has to pull you back up and painting all this. So he didn't finish this. They arrested him this morning, he said. I also learned a new word tonight, repel. I didn't even know what that was. So when he said it, I had to like, hmm, was it a rope? So repel. You never stop learning. He's still shining on there. Yeah, those four letters up there, they're brand new too. Hard to believe it's been four years since he passed away. Just because of fog, him and all the other people lost their life. What a story, huh? You train all your life to become the greatest and then something like this happened. I don't think the quality is too good with that front camera, but anyway, that was it. Live here from downtown Los Angeles. I feel pretty safe with all the cops around. Anyway, if you happen to like this video, you know what to do. Give it a thumbs up, push the notification bell, and subscribe to the German in Venice. Itchy, itchy, itchy. Nothing happened here tonight at the building. I was hoping to see something, but uh, who knows? See you guys later. Thank you for watching. Tschüssing.